Hello everyone, so I'm just making a short video on the topic CP versus DSA and what you should do for placements. So a lot of people might be wondering right now, aren't CP and DSA pretty much the same thing? Well, no, not really. The problems in computer programming and the problems in data collection algorithm are actually quite different from one another. And think about it, in DSA we have linked list, right? There's a lot of problems asked on linked list. But how often have you seen a linked list problem on code forces or code chef or hacker work? Chances are you've never seen a linked list problem on code forces or any other competitive programming website. And the reason for that is that the competitive programming problems are really different from classic DSA problems. So what should you do for placements or what's more important for placements? Well, both are important for placements. You need to have your competitive programming knowledge, your problem solving skills, and you need your classic DSA knowledge or classic DSA skills. Now, what happens when you go for placements is that you have to clear certain rounds like you need to clear your coding round, your aptitude round, your technical interviews, your coding interviews, your HR interviews before you get selected to the company. Now, what happens in a coding round is that you're given a certain time limit. So you might be given like two hours or two and a half hours or three hours and, in, and you're given certain coding problems. And you need to solve as many coding problems as you can, as quickly as you can within the time limit which is what happens in a competitive programming contest, right? For example, if you go on code forces, then they have div two rounds where you're given like two hours or two hours, 15 minutes, and you're given five or six problems. And you need to solve as many problems as you can within the time limit. Now, this is the same format that the companies use in their coding rounds. And then you have a coding interview where you're asked a problem and you need to solve that problem in front of the interviewer. And in the coding interview, the problems asked are generally DSA based. So it might be asked problems like invert a binary tree or reverse a linked list or problems like that. And these problems are really similar to the classic DSA problems of lead code. And you need to do both, right? You need to clear your coding round, you need to clear your coding interview. So how should you approach everything? Well, for clearing your coding round, go on code forces and try to solve as many div2 contests as you can and actually take the experience of how it is to solve problems under time constraint and against competition and try to solve problems till div 2 c or div 2 d because that's like the max difficulty that the companies generally ask in their coding rounds so go on code forces and try to solve or absolve problems till div 2 c or div 2 d and learn all the concepts necessary for that that will help you immensely in clearing your coding rounds now, coming to the coding interview, like I said, the problems asked are mostly DSA based. And for that, go on lead code. And for every DSA, like if you have linked list, then go on lead code, search linked list, and solve as many problems as you can till you feel confident. So go on lead code, for example, search linked list, solve as many easy problems as you can, as many medium problems as you can, and a few hard problems till you're confident. And this will make sure that you have the appropriate knowledge of DSA, and that will help you in clearing your coding interview. So you need like an appropriate or a perfect mix up of both competitive programming and DSA and that will help you and make sure that you clear your placements all together. I also have a video on how to clear the coding round of any company as well as how to master DSA for placements. I'll link them in the description. Make sure to check them out as well. And that's it for the video. If you have any doubts regarding this topic, just let me know in the comments. I'll be sure to answer. Thank you.